What's the haps? I'm Moroccan. Welcome, welcome, welcome back to Valhalla. We have a new client. This guy needs a voice. Um, I have pondered his voice for a little bit, and the only conclusion I can come to is he needs Arstotska voice. He looks like an Arstotska voice kind of guy. But Arstotska was, um, Papers, Please was the only time I ever did a voice that ridiculous, but I, I need to bust out that voice again because I really enjoyed doing that voice. And a lot of people really enjoyed me doing that voice, so hey. Big got the punch, first. Alright, he wants a good punch. I want to give him a gut punch, alright. Uh, G for gut punch is... Five Bronson Extracts, and one Flanadride with optional Karmatrine. Do I just give it, just top it up with Karmatrine? They did say it doesn't matter how much Karmatrine you put in, it doesn't make it big. Do I want to just n knock him out with a ridiculous amount of booze? I could do. This is, this is the, these are basically the choices you make in the game. Every time, there's, there's never a, which choice would you like to do? It's a, how much booze do you want to give this person, and do you want to give them the right kind of booze kind of decisions? Uh, yeah, I'm just gonna... Just say optional karma train, so... Doesn't really say how much. We're just gonna do that. Uh, oh, shoot, I... Ah... Uh, Uh-oh, reset. No. Did I lose money for that or something? I felt there was a ka noise. One, two, three, four, five. I didn't age it, that's the problem. Not that I know what aging is. That's genuinely not an actual drinks term. I, they've made that entirely up for the game, I think. They got this, aging. What the hell is aging? I worked in two bars, I work in drinks. I have n never heard of aging. Aging is not a thing. On the rocks, yes, that's a thing. Aging, no. What? What is this? You, there are... I can't help but feel there are other things you could probably have put in there that would have done the job instead of aging that would be actual cocktail making terms. But then again, I guess the ingredients are made up, so what? But yeah, what's aging? What, do I have to just sort of sit it for a while? It's like, just hang on, hang on, your drink will be with you in quarter of an hour, I just need to age it. No. Uh, so it's aged. There we go, that is a big ass gut punch with a lot of booze in it. Serve it up. Here. Yeah. Hmm, you can actually do it then. Hmm, this crack house is a bar? Hellhole crack house? It smells like dog urine and soap. How the hell do you expect someone to feel comfortable in here? I'm surprised you decided to come to our little crack house at all, mister. What the hell do you care? The payment registry says. Sorry for the question then, Mr. Ingram McDougall. Sorry about the smell, we're working on fixing it. There was an incident over the weekend. But it's Jules Day. Please, let me know what I can do to make your experience more pleasant regardless. If I pay you, will you come with me to a motel for a couple of hours? No. Then I have no use for you beyond giving me drinks. Such pleasant clientele tonight. May I ask why you decided to come to our bar then? Somebody recommended me this place and I have absolutely no idea why she likes it. She says she's a regular here and all. I'm starting to doubt her tastes. A regular? Can I ask who? No. Yet. I'll concede the one thing. Whoever picks the music at least has deep, decent taste. That'll be me. Oh, hang on. I, oh, I need to get in Scottish mode now. I wasn't expecting Scottish voices. Hey, Jill. Where did you put the grease soap? Gills run out. One of the sinks where it's always been. Right. Oh, customer. Good evening, sir. Hope you enjoy your stay at Valhalla. So, any other feedback you want to provide the establishment so we can enhance your customer experience? No, nothing at all. That's an interesting change of heart. I can't afford to slander this place knowing she's here. You know my boss? I don't know her, but I know who she is. Dana Zane, the Red Comet. The woman who fended off mall rioters all by herself, knocking them out cold one by one. That's an achievement and a title I've never heard before. I know boss did quite a few things before opening the bar, but that sounds... Would you happen to know how she got her mechanical arm? I heard a couple of stories, but they sound too fantastical to be true. You've had an interesting change of attitude. I saw that woman take out armed rioters with her bare hands. Once you see something like that, it's hard not to keep your mouth shut in front of them. Interesting. You can relax though, I've only seen her deal with clients personally about two or three times. One evolved class 5 weaponry, the other a pickup artist, and the latest had an alpaca. An alpaca? Not really an alpaca, but there's this woman that owns a textile company. She got really drunk, and she started screaming she was an alpaca. 
she started spitting on everything afterwards, my boss had to show her the exit. I'd rather not remember that night, so let's leave it at that. Can I get you anything else? And give me a pile driver, please. Please, there's a word I haven't heard today. Coming right up. He wants a pile driver? I honestly feel like suplexing him, though. That's actually a thing, isn't it? There is a drink called a suplex. Can I, what, what happens if I give him a suplex? I want to give him a suplex. Two, three, four. Uh, one, two, three. One, two, three. Do I make a big one? Let's make a big one. Why am I putting powdered deltrins? What the heck am I making here? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Flanagide. One, two, three, four, five, six. And uh, one, two, three, four, five, six. Carmatrine. Uh, on the rocks. Oop. And mixed. That's a suplex. Let's see how he likes it. Well, this isn't it, pal driver. It's a local drink. My coworker came up with it. He calls it a suplex. It isn't gonna blow up in my face, is it? No, it's safe. It's even been added to BTC's official recipe book. Good. Hey, lady, have you ever faked an orgasm? I I'm sorry, I think I heard wrong. I asked if you ever faked an orgasm. That's a question I'm not gonna answer. I'll take that as a yes. I was just thinking about how good a lie can be. I mean, even the most sincere of people lie once in a while. Lies can buy you time. Lies can make you happy. Reality will come crashing through the door eventually, but for that moment, the lie can give meaning for you. I say lies are like your porn stash. You know they exist, but you shouldn't acknowledge them. Does that mean you really faked orgasms? Because you look like you have a lot of experience. So that's quite the random thought to just suddenly have. Are you perhaps lying about something right now? Not really, I was just thinking about people making polite comments about this crack house. Of course you are. Hey, I'm gonna need another drink here. Already? Don't you think you're drinking a bit quickly? That's my problem, not yours. Give me a fringe weaver. Alright. Now has melted in mine. It's all watery now. Yeah. That's the disadvantage of doing this while you're recording, because I don't drink fast enough. I should be drinking his pace. <laughs> um, speaking of fun drinks, found a bar yesterday, in fact, that... Yeah, I'm gonna make it big. Uh, is that right? No, I want one more of those. I feel like I messed that up. That's got, that's got an odd number of things in. This should have two... That should, it should be full of karma tree, that's right. Uh, that apparently does a... It's a mixer that I never heard of. Apparently it's Jamaican called Ting. I guess Jamaicans can perhaps weigh in on that if there's any Jamaicans that watch my content. I don't know. Uh, Spice Rum and Ting. Beautiful drink. You guys have got a right, really good thing going on there. It's really expensive over here because we've got to import some stupid soft drink over here. Well, it's not stupid. It's great soft drink, but the fact that we have to import it makes it kind of expensive. So, Oh well. It, it's a really, really, really nice drink. Just saying. If I had Ting, I wouldn't be mixing ginger beer with it, but this is a very good ginger beer. Uh, ethylic alcohol with a spoonful of sugar. Uh, aged and mixed. Age. Boop, boop. There you go. Fringe weaver. Try not to drink it too fast. That's up to me. Hey, lady, have you ever felt empty? Empty how? Like, hungry? No, I mean, like, empty like there's a part of you missing. Can't say I particularly have. I just feel like there's this part of myself that lacks something. In order to get or do something that I just can't satisfy. You ever tried taking up a hobby? It might not solve your problems, but it might keep you, keep you busy enough to avoid thinking about it. Any suggestions? Well, collecting stuff, reading, bungee jumping, combat sports, exercising... Sounds a lot cheaper than the alternative. Which is? Bitches and alcohol. I tried sex tourism once, it was like a bloody Russian roulette of STDs, so I, I left halfway through. I once burned my Christmas bonus hiring three women for an orgy. Porn is more amusing and way cheaper. I've also hired a girl to act like my daughter for a day for three years in a row now. Nothing seems to do it. Um, have you tried rescuing a puppy? You can't fuck puppies. At least you shouldn't. I'm drawing a blank then. Can't think of anything that might help. I wasn't expecting you to help me. Hope to believe me. Eh? I could have been lying through my teeth this whole time. People lie, lady. Anyway, I'm leaving now. This smell is killing me. Please come again. Don't count on it. Good. Phew. 
Plus, I'm gonna take my break. Alright. Break screen. Oh my god, oh, or is this actually the title screen? Alright, it, it is just kind of a break, would you like to save the game kind of job. And it's a shame I can't just save anywhere. Most visual novels kind of do just let you save literally anywhere. But hey. Um, I'm just wondering whether I want to make these videos one customer per video. Or if I want to do more. I kind of want to do one customer per video. So I'm going to save. We're definitely going to save this thing on my break. Day one on my break. And I guess we could then get back to it. I might need a fresh drink before it. Uh, yeah, I'm going to do one customer per video. That means some of these videos are going to be a lot shorter than my current content, but it breaks it up nicely, I think. So yeah, thank you very much for watching. That was Erstotsky, a guy. I will see you next time.